Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression if we have square root of 16 minus square root of 12 and its whole square root. So we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form without using the calculator. So here you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem. This means that we need to show all of the working on this paper. So uh, here I hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. So now the very first thing we are going to do is first uh, we focus inside the square root sign as uh, you know that the square root of 16 is equals to 4 minus here we break this 12 as 4 multiplied by 3 and uh, here uh, again in the next step we uh, need to focus inside the square root sign and here we apply this nice radical law you know that if we have square root of a b it is equals to square root of a into square root of b so according to uh, this radical form uh, here uh, we rewrite this algebraic expression as this is our 4 we break this 4 as 3 plus 1 minus now here we apply this radical law and we, uh, we can apply uh, this square root separately on both of these values and it will become square root of 4 into square root of 3 and uh, now you see here uh, we uh, need to uh, make this into the whole square root form so for this we rewrite this expression as we write this 3 as square root of 3 and its whole square you, it means that this 2 and this square root are gone and we will get here 3 only and plus this is 1 and we write this 1 as 1 square minus here you see that this is square root of 4 and we know that square root of 4 is equals to 2 into this is our square root of 3. So uh, now further in the next step uh, we need to use here the nice algebraic formula you know about that if we have a minus b whole square is equals to a square plus b square minus 2 times of ab this is the our algebraic formula and uh, when we compare uh, the right hand side of this formula to the uh, above equation so you see here this term is our a square this term is our b square these two uh, be the two of the formula and this three square root of 3 is our a and here we write 1 and this 1 is our b so when you compare uh, the terms inside the square root sign and when we combine all of these terms so uh, we will get here uh, all of these terms into the whole square form so after combining uh, all of these terms inside the square root sign uh, it will be written as square root of here we have a minus b whole square and here our a is square root of 3 minus our b is 1 whole square so further in the next step uh, you see here this 2 and this square root are gone and we will get here square root of 3 minus 1 so uh, this is the our final simplified form of the given question and this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos